Uh, Dave Burns from Myra River, Cape Breton. There's not a whole lot to do. That's the really cool thing about the uh, Cape Breton music scene is you're bored as fuck. So people just play a lot of music and it's pretty, you, you get pretty tight doing that, sitting around. I was out in the middle of the woods. I think it was 45 minute walk to the next house when I was 16 years old and I sat and played guitar all day because I had no license, no car. So I sat there and played and played and played. Till my fingers blood, literally. When I was a kid, I had an older cousin. A bunch of us lived in the same fucking house because you couldn't. Now we were just dirt poor. So uh, we lived in the same place and uh, he had Kiss and uh, Judas Priest, Twisted Sister, when I first, that was the first album cover I'd ever seen on vinyl, Stay Hungry. And I was like, wow, this chick is ugly and he's eating a dog bone, or she is eating a dog bone. I was like, wait, that's a dude. And then I listened to him, I was like, this is awesome. And that was where, you know, stuff like that. He also had a collection of Conan the Barbarian comics. And uh, so I was into like, right away into the whole scene of seeing stuff that was just like gory and violent and just like horror movie stuff. So it got me into that kind of stuff at an early, early, early age. We're talking like six or seven, right? So I've been listening to metal for, well, a long time. The name of the jam space as a whole is called the Church of Destruction. It's uh, my friend Mike Atwell um, years ago started this place and it was very ragtag, you know, it's the basement of them all and it has 14 rooms or so and a main common area where there's a, you know, some pinball machine and the studio is called Fine Grind Studios and uh, I'm about the studio a couple of years ago and uh, I worked with my friend Bryce Holland. He's an amazing engineer. He's uh, gone to school for it and he's uh, he's very sought after.